Making the swirls on the metal is pretty simple. You can take one of these scotch pads and you can get these over at uh, Harbor Freight or wherever you want, you know, Granger. Uh, might even be able to find them at the big box stores, not sure. But all I did, this is a three or a uh, two inch, and all I do is stick it inside the chuck of my drill press. And I've got it set on a high speed right now. And I'll go ahead and start out with a couple of these and, and show you what I do. I'll take some sandpaper, we'll sand it down, and then we'll give it a shot and see what it looks like without, uh, without all the little rust in there. we still got some black spots, but we're going to see how that turns out. You'll notice what I'm doing is going in the same direction. I'm not going back and forth and I'm not using them all on the sides here. From my previous project I did a little bit of grinding on it. But uh, this here I'm just going back and forth in the same direction. It does make a difference in your your swirl pattern. Take a rag and just wipe it off here. Okay, I'll put it up here on the drill press and we'll take a look. Another thing I like about these pads is they just twist on and off. They're really simple. Just grab hold of it, twist it off, change it out, change your different uh, polishing wheels. So let's take a look at this and see what the sanded portion, the sanded metal does. Again, I'm going to start off about halfway there. There. Now that looks a lot better. So, even if you did it like this, you know, it, it doesn't look too bad. But right there, obviously, it... Uh, Turned out really, really good. So now let's take a look if I try and do a pattern back up this way and see if we can tell the difference between the two. I can see a difference from this point. I'm not sure. I'll have to wait and see what it looks like when I put this on the computer. But as you can see, it's very, very simple to make these. You can do this on aluminum, stainless steel. Uh, this is just some cheap steel that I bought from the box store. And um, you can make some uh, pretty decent little designs out of this, which I'll be doing in the future. So we'll talk at you later. Thanks for watching.